Yes, this style is no heat style. And if you like it and want to know how to do it, keep watching. Now you're going to need these rubber bands. Make sure they're stretchy. Some claw clips um, to hold the hair down as you braid. These cute little accessories, these clips to put on at the end. Um, some regular rubber bands to tie up the ponytail when you're done. And of course, a rat tail comb with one of my secrets, this beautiful, pure, neat conditioning shining gel. I love it. I made sure I did a lot of video on their texture because it's really important when you're looking at tutorial videos for braiding your daughter's hair. Um, it's helpful if the video shows the texture. So I think it's 4C and it's really thick. Now after I shampoo and condition the hair really good, I made this shea butter coconut oil, jojoba oil, um, lotion she's like what you doing show on youtube girl lotion and it makes it hair super soft this is all you need just to dab in your hand and when you rub it together it should look like this on your palms really thin and it's not really greasy either and you're gonna put it in and literally the hair is gonna soak it all up because i still left it damp but gonna massage all of the shea butter lotion in her hair because you want the hair moisturized and as you can see when i part it here it's super soft um it's not tearing apart it's not super dry and it's not hurting her um and that's important you don't want to hurt uh, your baby or your child or your client or whoever your hair you're braiding you want to make sure it's nice and moisturized after you uh, part the hair you want to do it in four sections like this you're going to neaten up the parts as we cornrow and i will show you uh, within the next clip how to part the main thing is placing that edge control or that gel i showed you in the part that you're trying to part then get your rat tail comb, place it within the area you're trying to part, and slide it down gently in the area in which you're trying to part. Slide it both down and upward so you can get that perfect neat line in regards uh, of the braiding of where you're trying to braid. And as you can see here, the part is very neat and that's all because of the rat tail comb and that amazing gel that I told you about. So you are now, after you part it and it's as neat as you like it, and I part the other side of the hair as well, you're going to braid upward because we're braiding her hair into a bun. So you braid each section that you parted the four sections. You're going to braid each section upward, if that makes sense. So keep braiding each braid upward towards the middle of the head for the ponytail. And I'll let you guys watch me do that. what the braids look like as I braid upward and when I'm all done this is what it looks like but it's gonna be one bun at the top then you're gonna get your kinky braiding hair cut it in the middle so it will not be long and we're gonna make a ponytail with this hair get the elastic band that you saw in the beginning and wrap it around and go through the hole of the rubber band which makes a ponytail just like that and then I tied it on the top of her hair and I shaped it to make the top of the bun and it's really cute she really loved it I thought it was adorable and it looks like her natural hair and also I have a twin daughter and I did hers into two buns like this. And when I did her two buns, I went ahead and did the ponytail like I showed you. And this is how it looks. Then I shaped it up with the scissors so it can look neat. 
decorated with these and we're all done they loved it super cute this is the back of both of my girls and i made sure i zoomed in a little closer for you guys so you can see it um it was super cute super simple and it looks very natural and i love doing natural styles on my daughters they're only 12 years old and i like my girls to look like little girls so super neat style um, I hope you guys try it out, and if you do, make sure you let me know and drop in the comments below of what other style you would like me to use. Thanks, guys. I love you. Please subscribe. Until next time, bye.